Today I want to show you the new single axle HD tilt called the T1 from PJ Trailers. The trailer that you see behind me is a 16 foot single axle tilt. It has a 13 foot tilting deck with a three foot stationary. It has a GVWR of 7,000 pounds, which gives you a cargo carrying capacity of 5,000 pounds. What we're going to do is a quick walk around from the very front coupler to the rear tail of this trailer. And we're going to show you how this trailer comes absolutely loaded with standard features. I want to remind you that the T1 we're looking at is bone stock. It has absolutely no options added to it. Everything you're going to see is a standard feature. So we'll start off with the front coupler. The front coupler is a two inch bulldog coupler. Everyone knows bulldog builds the best bumper pull and gooseneck couplers in the industry. You'll also notice that we went ahead and made the adjustable channel mount standard. This is going to give you five different positions to tow this trailer in. So whether you're towing this trailer with a half ton truck or a big jacked up three quarter ton pickup, you're gonna be able to put your coupler in the correct position that allows this trailer to tow evenly down the road. Behind that, you're gonna see that we have a big beefy five inch channel tongue. We used five inch because this truly is an HD single axle trailer with a 7,000 pound GVWR. Uh, behind that, you're gonna notice that we have a bargeman seven way wiring harness. This bargeman plug has got dual contacts inside of it. They're known for their extreme reliability. Behind that, you're gonna see a Pro Series 8K jack. This is a top line jack. The great thing about this jack is, after you hook up to the truck, all you have to do is turn the crank a few times, get the weight off of the trailer jack and onto the truck. Then you'll simply pull a pin beneath, slide the drop leg in, pin it, and you're good to go. So you no longer have to wind this jack all the way up to a towing position. Behind that, you're gonna see that we have an expanded metal chain tray. This chain tray, again, is totally standard. That's really important. It's gonna basically extend your trailer deck and give you an extra place to uh, haul tools, materials, um, a cooler if you're using this trailer on the weekend will go fantastic right here. Also, if you were to order this trailer with an optional toolbox, the toolbox would go here over the tongue. Now we're gonna move on and take a look at the deck. The very first thing you'll notice is this big custom bullnose front bumper. The reason we went with the bullnose front bumper is this gonna allow you to pull your vehicles or side-by-sides onto the trailer and pull them all the way forward. This gives you maximum length on this 16-foot trailer. Behind it, you'll notice that we have mitered front corners. That's gonna give you a little bit of extra maneuverability and clearance to take this trailer into tight places. You'll also see that we have a steel diamond plate front board cap. That board cap's important because it allows us to run our lumber underneath the cap, keeping the treated lumber as it ages from trying to peel or curl up. You'll also notice that this trailer comes with recessed D-ring standard. You get four recessed D-rings, two in the front, two in the rear. You also get a center D-ring that's really great for winching onto the tilt. Now we'll move on to talk about the tilting deck portion of the trailer. One thing I wanna point out is that it's a 13 foot tilt deck, whether you order a 13 or a 16 foot trailer. Also, it's always gonna have a low 11 degree load angle, allowing you to load multiple types of equipment and vehicles easily onto this trailer. It comes with treated number two Southern Yellow Pine standard. We also do three inch channel cross members on 16 inch centers, just like our bigger tandem axle T6 tilt. The other thing that makes this trailer super HD is the five by two tubing on the trailer frame. This is really important because it gives it added strength and it allows us to run our wiring inside of the tubing itself, protecting it from outside elements. Beneath the deck, we have a hydraulic cushion cylinder system. That's important because as you drive onto the tilting deck, it has hydraulic cushioning and lowers the deck down slowly. As you back off, the deck comes up slowly. We also have a positioning valve that allows you to keep the deck in the up position by simply turning a valve, which is great for when you're loading multiple vehicles. Now we're gonna move on and talk about the running gear. First thing I wanna point out is this trailer comes with a Dexter 7,000 pound drop axle. That axle is really important because it allows us to get this ultra low 21 inch deck height. It's also important that it's made by Dexter. Their axles are known for reliability, durability, and they're really easy to maintain with the easy lube system. Outside of that, you get an ARC 16 inch powder coated wheel, a provider 235-80 radial tire, a removable steel diamond plate fender that has three quarter inch LED bullet lights. Now let's take a look at the tail portion of this trailer. 
Every T1 tilt comes with stake pocket standard. The 13 foot version has eight stake pockets and the 16 foot version has 10. Stake pockets are great because they're gonna allow you to add sides onto the trailer or use as extra tie down points. Behind the stake pocket, you're gonna see our flush mount lifetime LED lights. We flush mount these lights with a rubber grommet. That way, if you ever back into something, the light has a little bit of cushion and it's flush to this big, heavy steel box. That's gonna protect this light for many years to come. You'll also see that we have a knife edge tail. The knife edge tail is really important for loading vehicles with small tires. It makes it really smooth and easy to transition onto the tilt deck. You'll also see the recessed D-rings that we mentioned earlier in the video. Thanks for taking a look at our single axle HD T1 tilt. If you'd like to see a list of available options and your nearest dealer for a T1, visit pjtrailers.com. If you'd like to see the T1 in action, make sure to check out our T1 uses video.